Hey everyone, thank you so, so, so much for clicking on this Netflix review. The fact that you are willing to sacrifice a few minutes out of your day to consume my content really does mean the world to me. Today we're going to be talking about The Night Agent, which is a series that really took me by surprise. I thoroughly, thoroughly enjoyed it. And if all you're going to take away from this review is that this show is good, then that's good enough for me because The Night Agent really, really surprised me and did really well in my opinion is actually captured one of the the hardest things I think that Netflix has been struggling with lately and that's to actually write a likable protagonist and build a, a show around characters we actually care about. So straight off from the beginning the show was enjoyable, it was captivating and it was engaging. Ultimately we follow our protagonist Peter who is a low-level FBI agent as he is trying to solve a massive conspiracy which has the entire political landscape of America at stake and so it's up to him to ultimately save America, its citizens and bring balance back to the political landscape. But straight off the bat as I said Peter is an incredibly likable character. He's someone who cares about others, someone that wants to step out of the shadow of his father who was um, accused of and quite a few bad things. So it's about him trying to build his own legacy as well, which is always something that I can appreciate. It's a theme I really, really enjoy. But across the board, I think this was a great show. Brilliant actors across the board. I think everyone was cast perfectly for their roles. Um, they were definitely helped by the script. I think the script was incredibly, incredibly strong. And all of that ties together to really push forward this incredibly compelling narrative, this incredibly exciting story. I'm not necessarily one who enjoys the the more grounded, um, you know, cop dramas. This isn't necessarily a cop drama, but it falls within that like sub-genre of drama. Um, and the thriller suspenses and the thriller elements that are definitely within the show really captivating as well. So there was a lot of pros to enjoy about this show, from well-written characters to intense drama, suspenseful drama, but also some very, very well choreographed scenes. There's a scene in the very first episode where Peter is chasing down a criminal. He gets hit by a car. It is one of the most brutal car hit and runs I've seen in a very long time in a movie and a show. And so it's not afraid to get a little bit more aggressive with its action, a little bit more um, hard hitting, which is something I really, really enjoyed about the show. You, you do get that idea that there is always suspense, that there's always tension because you never truly know which characters are safe and which ones could be offed at any second. So yes, if I had to really look for something wrong with this show, if I really had to like go, hmm, this is the issue, I would say there are elements of the story that could be somewhat predictable. I'm not going to pretend that, hey, you could see everything coming from a mile away. There are a few things here and there, though, that if you are really just paying attention, you'll be able to pick up on. And there were, I would say, one or two massive twists or plot points that I was predicting but it's not to say that they were anything other than educated guesses. I, I never once went, oh, flip, that was so obvious. Um, and so that's always worthwhile. I mean, we want to be on the edge of our seats while watching a show like this. We want to not necessarily be second guessing our own opinions and our own feelings. But in a show like this where you don't know who you can trust, you don't know who the villains are, you don't necessarily even know who the heroes are, you want to have that aura of the unknown. And this show really handled that very well. So yes, guys, that's my review on The Night Agent. If you enjoyed it, please let me know down in the comments below. And if you had any issues with it, I'd love to hear your issues as well. But guys, thank you so much for watching this review. If you enjoyed it, please give it a like. Do not be afraid to subscribe to my channel. And I hope to see you again in another review.